Assalamu alaikum, my brothers and sisters. Peace be upon you. Welcome to Minutes to Paradise. Divorce in Islam is a legally and religiously sanctioned process, allowing a married couple to dissolve their marriage. Islamic law or Sharia outlines specific procedures and guidelines for divorce. It's important to emphasize that divorce is discouraged in Islam and should only be considered as a last resort when all attempts at reconciliation have failed. Key aspects of divorce in Islam include types of divorce, talaq. This is initiated by the husband and can be given in two ways. Talaq al-sunnah. The husband pronounces divorce once and waits through the waiting period, idda, during which the wife cannot remarry. Talaq al bidah the husband pronounces divorce three times in one sitting, which is discouraged by many Islamic scholars and may be considered invalid in some regions. Kula. This is initiated by the wife, who seeks divorce through a legal process by offering something of value to her husband in exchange for her release from the marriage. Fask. This is a divorce initiated by a religious judge or authority, typically due to specific legal grounds, such as abuse or neglect. Ida. Waiting period. After the divorce pronouncement, there is a mandatory waiting period during which the divorced woman cannot remarry. This period is typically three menstrual cycles or three months if the woman is not menstruating. Financial obligations. The husband is generally responsible for providing financial support to his divorced wife during the waiting period. Ida. If she is pregnant, he is also responsible for her financial support until she gives birth. Child custody. Custody of children after divorce is generally awarded to the mother until a certain age, after which the father may gain more rights. Specifics can vary based on local customs and legal systems. Reconciliation. Islam encourages reconciliation efforts between spouses during the waiting period. If reconciliation is successful, the divorce can be revoked. Remarriage. After the idda waiting period has ended, both the divorced husband and wife are free to remarry including each other, if both parties agree and the divorce was revocable. Legal procedures. The exact legal procedures for divorce can vary among Islamic countries and schools of thought. It often involves registering the divorce with a legal authority. Counseling and mediation. Many Muslim communities advocate seeking counseling and mediation from religious leaders or counselors before proceeding with divorce. It's crucial to approach divorce in Islam with utmost seriousness and in accordance with Islamic principles. Different Islamic schools of thought may have variations in their interpretation of divorce rules, so practices may differ among Muslim communities. Seeking guidance from a knowledgeable religious scholar or authority is often advisable when dealing with divorce in an Islamic context.